name is Thanks Peter. It is Monday. You are there. I am here. Welcome to the Monday show. Let's get straight into it, dog. It's been a while. Ladies and gentlemen, viewer mail! Viewer mail, viewer mail, let's see what we got today in the viewer mail. So you may notice in the back there, there's a wonderful painting. This was sent to me by a young lady named Greta. It came in a huge box. Greta, if you're out there, Hi, it's an awesome painting. Look at this. And it's just my state of blue. This first letter comes to us from Hanson in Brick, New Jersey. New Jersey. Known for glamour, prestige. Hanson writes, I drew you the epic rap battle of history. I really like them, so keep it up. A full scale drawing of all the faces. The epic rap battle of history. It's gonna be crazy, man. We're gonna do two a month for the rest of the year. So at the end of the year, we're gonna have so many. It's gonna be crazy, man. This is exciting. It's kind of big and flimsy, and it comes to us from Andrew in Marion, Indiana. Indiana, known for glamour and prestige. This is interesting. I got a DVD of something called The Ghost Warriors, a web series that we did on YouTube called Ghost Warriors. It's a comedy improv ghost hunting show. I'm going to show this to my old roommate, Mary, and I think she's going to love it. She loves those ghost hunter type shows. Hello. Oh my God, did you hear that? Did you hear that? This comes to us from Miss Rebecca in South Woodsley, Ontario. I think that's in Canada, right? Nice, Peter. I was gonna rake a really cool pick for you, but alas, my marker seems to have run out. Now that may seem sad, but it gave you the opportunity to use the word alas, which is a great word. I'm glad you decided to share your art with me and you ran out your marker at the very end. That's actually kind of cool. I like to do that with my chapstick. I like to use it until it's gone. Worn to the nub, like the hammer in Shawshank Redemption. By the way, this is the kind of chapstick I use. It's called Dr. Bronner's Magic Naked Chapstick. That concludes today's segment of viewer mail. Let's move on to some new and exciting news. Me and Dante got a piano. So. We found a piano on Craigslist. I've wanted a piano for some time. You may remember I was working on a song called Boobies. I haven't been able to finish the song because I haven't had a piano and I really wanted to record it on a real piano. It's not that expensive to get one from Craigslist. But what made today special was I was just like, you know what, today's the day. I'm just gonna do it. We went and we rented a U-Haul truck. I feel like a bigger man being in a big truck. And while we were driving, we passed this awesome old lady in an old school VW Bug. Then we met this old dude named Bert. He's not that old. Don't get me wrong, Bert, if you're watching, you're not that old, but you're older than me, so I'm just calling you an old dude. This dude named Bert was awesome. He used to party with Keith Richards. He sold us his piano, and he gave us a trombone. This <laughs> tastes like old people. A very cool person I know taught me this kind of lesson. When you have something you have to do, just do it right then. Don't be like, ah, I'll do that later. Do it now! Try it the next time. You'll feel really good. Like next time you have something you have to do, just be like, bam, I'm doing this now. I'm knocking this out. I'm crossing it off my list, dog. Right there, I just crossed off, just do it now. And boobies, I crossed those off my list as things I wanted to talk about. So I want to ask your advice. Oh, here's my spinny transition. Yeah! Oh, don't do your spinny transition when your keyboard's sticking out because you'll hit it with your knee. So I want to ask you a question. I want to start making more merchandise-y type -y things. This is where it gets a little weird for me. I don't want to turn into like a shopping mall. Hey man, you going down to Nice Peter channels? Yeah, can you pick me up some milk while you're there? So I put it to you. What kind of merchandise would you like to see? Well, anything. Be anything. I'm open to all your ideas. I'm going to be reading them because I really have no idea what to make. I'll put an email address on the channel page. You have a design for a t-shirt that you think would be cool. I'm all ears. Eyes. I'm all eyes. That's all for me. Have a wonderful week. Keep your head up. Keep your ideas flowing. Keep your positivity in your body and let it out. And uh, if you get an idea, do it right now. If you find something you got to do, go do it. And I look forward to seeing you again next week. Okay, bye. Oh, yeah.